Leviticus chapter 2, Holman Christian Standard Bible. When anyone presents a grain offering as a gift to the Lord, his gift must consist of fine flour. He is to pour olive oil on it, put frankincense on it, and bring it to Aaron's sons, the priests. The priest will take a handful of fine flour and oil from it, along with all its frankincense, and will burn this memorial portion of it on the altar, a fine offering of a pleasing aroma to the Lord. But the rest of the grain offering will belong to Aaron and his sons. It is the holiest part of the fire offerings of the Lord. When you present a grain offering baked in an oven, it must be made of fine flour, either unleavened cakes mixed with oil or unleavened wafers coated with oil. If your gift is a grain offering prepared on a griddle, it must be unleavened bread made of fine flour mixed with oil. Break it into pieces and pour oil on it. It is a grain offering. If your gift is a grain offering prepared in a pan, it must be made of fine flour with oil. When you bring the Lord, when you bring to the Lord the grain offering made in any of these ways, it is to be presented to the priest, and he will take it to the altar. The priest will remove the memorial portion from the grain offering and burn it on the altar, a fire offering of a pleasing aroma to the Lord. But the rest of the grain offering will belong to Aaron and his sons. It is the holiest part of the fire offerings to the Lord. No grain offering that you present to the Lord is to be made with yeast, for you are not to burn any yeast or honey as a fire offering to the Lord. You may present them to the Lord as an offering of first fruits, but they are not to be offered on the altar as a pleasing aroma. You are to season each of your grain offerings with salt. You must not omit from your grain offerings the salt of the covenant with your God. You are to present salt with each of the offerings. If you present a grain offering of first fruits to the Lord, you must present a fresh head of grain, crushed kernels, roasted on the fire for your grain offering of first fruits. You are to put oil and frankincense on it. It is a grain offering. The priest will then burn some of its crushed kernels and oil with all its frankincense as a fire offering to the Lord.